2003, they had an inkling that a technology called RFID, which stood for Radio Frequency Identification, was going to begin. Now, Europe was taking on to RFID for several applications and would need cheap suppliers. However, that big break did not come from Europe, but from their own country, which was India. It was in 2005 that they were selected over a foreign manufacturer to supply X to Y. Y in turn saved over rupees 50 crores because of the partnership to APK identification. Of course, X and Y are synonymous, so no half points. X is the product, Y is the <coughs> company to which it was provided. X is the product, Y is the company. Few more seconds on the buzzer. Probably again one of the funda based questions. Jack Korea. Answer. Sorry? No? Okay. QR code. QR code and Toyota no. QR code question was asked at uh, BB, right? You had answered that if I remember. TMF. Indigo. Oh, airlines, okay. And what is cheap meal on board? That's his one. Okay. <laughs> the swipe pack. Easy. You see. No. Big, big. What? The EVM. EVM. That was Rangarajan, right? Rangarajan, who was working as an engineer, who also wrote the screenplay for the Rajivan Starrer robot. He was a Tamil poet. No. Okay. Use my discretion. Too bad I am Kigaziabad. It's the token in Delhi Metro as well as the Calcutta Metro, but this is the Delhi Metro token identification. Five points to Team E. Let's have a look at the answer. That's the technology, Delhi Metro and the coins. Okay. A bigger round of applause for this team. Five points. I said no half points, but you came really, really close. It's not the swipe cards, it's the tokens. Good answer that. Extra food points. Yes, Sebastian's answer. I think this is American tourister. American tourister sold off to Samsonite. Dinner. It's not Hermes. Auntie. Passing. Alpha was VIP brand. Are Baba? Rakesh Nimwala. Heritage. La Coste. La Baba. Same answer as this. Okay. What is this? Yes, right there at the back. Absolutely fantastic. Hartman languages. Let's have a look. She deserves a round of applause for that. Hartman language. And I take a claim to two chocolates. Very, very good answer that. Hartman languages. Okay. A favorite brand for the money launderers. TMF, you would have the last question. And I suppose that is the end of it. Yes, question four. Other teams, team A and team C look very sharp on the buzzer. You are tied for the second spot. An accounting term that dates back to the Anglo-Saxon times, where it was deemed to be the value of a cow in Kent or a sheep elsewhere. Which currency are we talking about? A diminutive currency. A fraction of a currency. A fraction of a currency. On this, okay, team F will answer. Absolutely shilling, good answer that, fraction, shilling, team C, too bad, you should have passed on that, but we didn't want to take that risk, shilling, good answer that. That concludes the first semi-final, it was short, but uh, I guess all the teams first deserve a round of applause. No story, guys, can we have the scores up? Can we have the scores up on the screen? I guess there is a tiebreaker situation. Here it is. Winner all the way. Live up to that winning 75 points. Very, very good. Team A and Team C will wait for a while, but we 